Sup guys, it's me, Plop Plop Player Six, and we're back on my survival world. We left off in my house to explain what we're gonna do next. Hopefully, by the time I am done with my next project on the world, this right, our farm right here, could have some stuff growing. We can probably make some bread, and maybe get some wheat. So we can start getting sheep. It looks like we left off almost at night time, man. Eh? So let's start. What I was going to do is I was going to make a mine. We're, we can start on that later. Because I, as you can tell, we are not prepared enough. Um, survive night yet. Yes, yeah, sleeping with a shovel is really normal, guys. So, don't mind me if I do it. It's normal. It's 100% safe and fine. Fine. So now, we're going to start going mine. Because we're going to need to survive. Of course, we're going to need iron, diamonds, all that good stuff. And we will need a lot of stone and stuff like that. Oh, I messed it up right here. There we go. Now let's do this. Like an entrance. Hopefully we can get some coal at least, because I'm definitely going to need torches. Ooh, we just stumbled upon a cave. I'll get to that later. So what do I want to do now that we have some materials is that I want to, I want to like, Organize the house a bit, like uh, not organized, but like I want to like design it more. Yeah, that's what I'll, the word I was looking for. Design it more. Like we're gonna change the. Floor to stone. Get some oak logs. Those, because we're gonna need oak logs definitely. Those will come in handy. All right. This is looking nice. So I don't have any oak logs, so yeah, I'm gonna have to go chop some trees down over here. And of course, this fence messes me up. Ooh, I almost fell there. Oh, 
don't worry, Big Tree. Later on, I'll come to you when... Jeez, it's so laggy right now. But don't worry, Big Tree. I'll come to you later. I don't need to try and waste more of this new axe to just get, like, five pieces of the wood there. I just need oak logs. And big tree, you know why? Another reason why I don't want to chop you? Because I'm probably not going to finish it. Not finishing it, it's kind of a disgrace to humanity and it looks very weird. spawn when it rains. Wish me luck that I can't be trapped. Oh yeah, that's good for the crops though. But, oh my god, wish me luck. Hopefully mobs don't spawn. make up a, a, a project if we're going to be trapped inside the house and mob spawn. So what I'm going to do is make a basement. Yeah, that's a good idea. Mm -hmm. Here, here, or here. Yeah, let's make a basement right there. Wait, do I have spruce planks somewhere? Nope, okay. Wait, when did I get jungle planks? I don't know. Wait, that's not so supposed to go there. It's just supposed to not go on that block. It's supposed to go like that. Alright. Ladders were like this. Am I correct? Okay. Yeah. Alright. I think six ladders should be good. The two only two dirt blocks. That's kind of strange. Now we just gotta dig this area out. All right, now we have a new pickaxe. torches I can use like I can use them for when we go mining later imagine we just find like an ore while building the basement. Now I kind of want to build it this way. Because we have to have a project to like, inter be like entertaining while we build the basement. 
Also, guys, do you want me to, like, cut parts of the video? Like, so it makes it shorter? Or do you want me to, like, have no to a little cut to see a lot of the gameplay? I want to know what you like better. Because, I mean, I'm willing to do whichever one you like. It's pretty much up to you guys. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to change all this stone into cobblestone. Forgot that's what I was doing. I'm pretty sure it's nighttime. Yeah, it's definitely nighttime. I saw a zombie out my window. And that's also why I'm happy I have windows. But of course, they're not gonna. Oh yes! Also, the rain stopped. I'm willing to get the Monster Hunter achievement. Yes. No, it didn't drop Rod and Flesh. That would have come in. Rod and Flesh would definitely come in handy. Because even, like, if you're stuck in a cave and you really have nothing to rely on, Rod and Flesh you will come in handy. Seems like my sugarcane farm is going on along well. There's a Technoblade pig. Some sheepies. I'm just hoping I can see a cow. Ooh, this might be the cave I found in my mind. Ah, lag. This video was not as, la last video was not as laggy. I don't want to do a whole exploration though. I just want to wander off a little bit. And yeah. Looks like there's a cave right there. Ooh, wait. Oh. If you like walk back from there, if you can see that, it looks like it's almost as if it's like a village house. Ooh, chickens. I can use their. Oh yes, lucky egg. Another egg. Okay, that's good. Now either I will make a cake. Oh, I don't want to waste my time on. Oh, for a second I thought my own house was a village house. Oh yeah. Since it stopped raining, let's... Ooh, this is an oak tree. Okay. I was gonna say, let's go chop down some oak, oak trees. This is good. Okay, there's another oak tree. Over here. Leave that other tree and this tree might be just a perfect these two last two trees might be just the perfect amount for the finishing touches to like the outer part of my starter base most like most likely either we're going to expand expand this base or we're gonna move bases. But, at the, since this is only the second episode, it really could just be anything. Now we're most likely going to go mining to get iron stuff. 
because we definitely probably will need iron stuff so we can we will need iron stuff so we can mine this faster so i'm gonna go mine it and also so we have more durability because you might have noticed this but my pickaxe looked different when i was almost broken that's because i have a dur one of the research packs is a changes the texture when it's like low on lower and lower on durability There we go. The basement is pretty much finished. Just gotta, you know, like. Oh yeah, I can hear a skeleton. We are not gonna deal with that cave yet. Even if it does have iron, I'm not willing to die yet because if you've watched my infinite survival streams you've probably seen that I've caught in some pretty tough situations in a cave while starting out and okay why is all of this granite like oh diorite now it's granite yeah granite diorite and now andesite jeez not a single piece of stone like it's all the other stone types Let's just act like he never saw this. You know what? I'll just strip mine this way since we have like the best luck of finding big caves that are for people who have fully enchanted diamond or iron armor. Okay, at least we found them cool. That's good. Also, if you guys want to download the resource packs I have enabled, these, if you want to get them just tell me in the comments and then in this or the next episode or maybe in like my community post something i will put the download to the mo the resource packs and it is in the in it oh geez my pickaxe is about to fall apart this is why we need iron Rest in peace, pig axe, bro. At least I got a whole 28 iron bits from that. Sometimes I feel like strip mining is better than mining. Alright, let's check on my... It's going pretty good. Hopefully I can just find some bones from skeletons that died later on or just get bones from a structure maybe later on I can get bone meal because I might be able to I'm not might not be able to tame you beasts yet if I if I don't if I'm not able to grow my wheat in this episode but who knows, maybe I have something that could help. Well, 
Like, let's see, let's see. Oh yeah, my buried treasure map. Still don't know where it is. When I go that way, is it like, it's like, I don't know how maps work in Minecraft. So going this way, that, that way is backwards, this way is forwards, so it's this way left, well not left, right. No, that's still going up, what about this way? That's going down. That's why I don't understand maps. Like, they're both the same direct, like, they all have the same direction. Whoa. My only, my only reasonable answer is it's that way, like that way, but I mean, we'll never know. Let's, it's turning night time. Let's craft another pig axe. We're breezing through pig axes here. Oh yeah, I have the eggs. I could possibly get the chickens in my farm. Chickens are useful, I guess, cause like, um, you can get Feathers and stuff. And feather feathers are useful in some situations. Like a booking quill if April Fool comes. And I can, like, they re add the April Fool's dimension. Alright, so I got all that coal now. Now let's continue. Oh, yeah, we gotta add a torch here. Now we gotta. Wait, we can just continue mine until it gets a little dark. I swear, I keep on hearing the bone clack, the bones of the skeleton. Skelly, Skelly, where are you? Oh, for a thing, I thought that sheep was a cow. Jeez, I have so many sheep, just n no wheat at all. When will this wheat grow? This one looks like it's almost done. This one looks like it's almost done. And then these don't look like it's finished at all. Then the sugar cane is going well. I'm just gonna take all that sugar cane. There we go. All right, how do you craft paper again? Like that, okay. All right, six pieces of paper. Now all I need is leather. Mm. 
since it seems like cows do not spawn, I'm pretty, I'm probably 100% wrong, but I'm pretty sure they don't spawn in a Caden of biomes. Then I'm just on the search for cows. This video probably isn't going to be as entertaining as the last one. But it's just setting a bunch of stuff up. It's definitely going to be shorter, I know that for sure. Sheep, chicken, these pig, I saw in the corner of my eyes, wolves, there's just one animal missing, cows, these pesky little creatures are hiding from me. Well, can't find cows, can't get leather, can't get books. Can't get books equals can't get enchantment table. And just books in general. Because books are pretty important. Well, guess we'll have to get a cow farm the second we find our first two cows. Then we will make them breed for infinity. And after we make them breed for infinity, then we are going to um demolish them, eat some of them, and then make them breed more. Just one more. You just you're like at 99% growth, bro. Keep on living, bro. Keep on living. All right. So. That. Oh, search for cows over. Let's go back mining. Oh, yeah. Torches. Where's my sticks? Let's just make as many torches as we can. I'm pretty sure we're gonna be making 20, okay, 28 torches. I was just calculating there. The strip line is this way. I'm gonna move like that, so I have it easier to access. Have we mined into the ocean? Yes, we have. I just saw water. Look at that. We mined into the ocean itself. Well, if we mined into the ocean, that means we're going to mine further, far, further away from the ocean to get more stuff. I swear there's going to be a mining montage in the video. See the texture changed. It looks like it doesn't change when it's in your hand. That would be really cool if it did, though. This is gonna be like my fourth or fifth pig that pickaxe I've gone through. I need the iron badly. Okay, I'm pretty sure we're probably gonna end the video here. Not much has happened unless something happens right now, which will be nothing.
Imagine we get to end the video on sleeping. That's gonna be yes. I knew it. I knew it. We have our first piece of wheat. first piece of wheat. Finally, after like a whole two Minecraft days of grinding, we have our first piece of wheat. Now we can start getting sheepies. Come on, sheepies. Follow Papa. Follow Papa. And when I am able to get shears, I can start breeding these sheep. And after I breed the sheep, I will get another sheep. That's going to be the end of this video. We ended it off with a farm. So that's pretty epic. I'll see you guys in the next one. Hope you enjoy enjoyed episode two. Um, we're going to end it off sleeping. Good night and bye.